All right, so last episode, Orange Morton commented, you should add water driplets from the ceiling in the pool area. I think that's a great idea. Let's do it. It doesn't match the water from the shader, but I think it still adds something, so I'm gonna keep it. Added some over there, and then right here, and then some over here. Yeah. By the way, if you missed it, we made this in the last episode. Check it out. Why trade off commented, where is the entrance to the XP farm? There isn't one, so let's build one. We're going to continue extending this river along this path, so we got to get rid of this house. Start digging out a layout. We're also going to need to move the farm, so move these guys over. So we'll make a nice little pen for these guys here. First, we got to flatten out the area. Got a rough shape now. Oh, shit. Now we can get rid of this. made this little tree right here if you just yeah we gotta we gotta light the rest of this up all right there we go I went ahead and added some wheat to the uh, cow farm there and I added some horse dirt to make it look like they've been like stomping around and stuff. I also added like the hidden lighting to the farm. Let's go ahead and finish filling in the rest of this river with dirt. Let's go ahead and make a waterfall right here. Do that first, we gotta make a little lake up here. There we go. Maybe have it like spread out into the water a little bit. I honestly gotta see it in the daytime, I'm not really sure right now. Um no, nah, it's it's way too much for such like a small waterfall. I think that looks fine. Theoretically, like, there's gonna be the most mist around here, so that does not look right. Alright, that looks fine. 
I'm not gonna mess with it. So last episode, Ben Gibbs commented, you should make a windmill. I think that's a great idea, so that's what we're gonna do right here. All right, I just went ahead and collected like most materials I think I'm gonna need for this. These are gonna be for the actual like windmill part, like the actual blades and stuff. Got some lanterns, gonna stick to like the same theme I got going on. And I've actually never made a windmill, so hopefully it doesn't look horrible. Also, um, yeah, this is just missing. I was out of wood, I needed some wood. That's fine though, we'll, we'll tear that down and remake that after the windmill. Bring this up to about four blocks high. Kind of adds like more of a base to it. All right, now we're gonna go in one. We can just fill this in. Go ahead and build some pillars up now. Then we can start adding some detail with these. Let's go one higher. Then we're gonna go in one more. And I want this part to be more tall and like narrow. Maybe one more. Actually, let's make this roof a little more fancy. Let's add blocks here. And then stairs on top of that. And we'll do this. Probably should have brought some scaffolding. Life hack, use leaves as scaffolding. It's way better than actual scaffolding. All these creepy crawlies, man. Now the grindstones. Add some of these thingies. I saw another design that people use these, so I'm using that as well. All right, now it's time for the actual blades. Probably something like that. Now we gotta do all four of them. There we go. Yeah, I don't. I don't know how I feel about that. Yeah, I don't... Yup. No. Yup. Now I want to add trapdoors to each blade. And that's going to be extremely annoying. And we also don't have enough. We have to go get that. And I want Bruce trapdoors so I can like mix it up. Add more detail. And we're done. I really like the way the blades turned out. I used inspiration from other people's builds online. I think it turned out pretty good. Now we're gonna go ahead and tear this down and make a nice little small house here. I have an extra set of iron armor here and just more armor from the skeleton farm there. All right, now that this house is here, this spot's looking a little bit empty, so I'm gonna make a tree right here. Oh bro, I love the way this is looking. It's coming together. Dude, this area is looking so nice. Especially that windmill. And that tree. And the house, honestly. Lights at night look awesome. <laughs> Last thing before we end the episode is I want to continue working on the sewer. Extend it back more and have a have an intersection where it turns left right.
If you have any ideas for this area, please let me know. I'm thinking maybe drag the sheep down here, honestly. Uh, behind here, it just stops. There's nothing here. Just for looks. I think that's a lot better than what we had before, though. Try to leave comments that are more of suggestions than, like, big builds to do. I usually have things planned for episodes, so I can't just, like, make a, you know, a castle if you comment that. Anyway, that's going to be the end of the episode. So I'm going to leave you guys with a little tour of everything we've built so far.